we think of a freestanding ER, we think of the exact same facility as we would inside a hospital. It provides the same level of care, it provides the same imaging services, uh, and so people can go there in an emergency, and a freestanding emergency room has the ability to stabilize. So the facility can take care of anything that an emergency department can take care of. So anything from serious life-threatening, timely uh, illnesses such as stroke, heart attacks, um, serious infections, to anything from a laceration, uh, a fracture, and anything in between. It's different than an urgent care because it provides full emergency medicine services. Um, it has a CAT scan, x-ray, ultrasound, and is staffed here by board certified emergency medicine physicians and emergency medicine trained nurses. We are incredibly excited to establish another access point for those in need of emergency medical care. Oh. This project represents $12 million investment and the creation of some 30 new jobs, which contributes to the growing economic base of Roanoke County. Responsive and efficient levels of care are essential to a community, and I'm certain our citizens and our businesses will appreciate having 24-hour access to emergency services where they live and work here in the 460 corridor. As we look at the Roanoke Valley and we look at the growth of in the different areas, what we recognized is that this was an area that was underserved. And what we wanted to do was bring health care here. Uh, we see that the zip codes for people getting health care continues to grow in this area. And so it's important to us. So we have Cave Springs, which is a very busy facility in a very busy area. And now we're going to have the Blue Hills freestanding emergency room. We think that this area will continue to grow, not just people with residents, but also people working here. Our mission is to serve our community and this community was lacking an emergency access point to be able to receive high quality, efficient emergency medicine care. And now we're able to start providing that for this community. And that, that's what we do day in and day out, is, is help our community and help them achieve better healthcare outcomes when they need us. We think this is a great opportunity here in the Bonsack area. We think that there's other access points, whether we go south towards Wythe County, whether we go south towards Martinsville, that can support the folks who need the care from Lewis Gale Regional Health System.